Well, a newborn baby is a cause for celebration and joy, but having a baby can be very expensive. Which you don't think of mm -hmm. right away. Parents of newborns spend an average of $100 a week on formula and $75 a week on diapers. And that's why WISC-TV is hosting a three-day community-wide baby shower. We're collecting infant supplies to help families in need. Dr. Jill Masana is an OBGYN with Associated <laughs> Physicians, and she joins us now live. Hi, Dr. Masana. Welcome Hi, to Live welcome. at Four. Hi, hello, now, thank you for having me. Nice to see you. How <laughs> critical is it for newborns to get off to a solid start? Yeah, absolutely. So we know, um, you know, it's important throughout the pregnancy for the mom to be nice and relaxed. Um, we know that stress throughout um, the pregnancy can lead to complications later on. I think one of the things that really leads to that stress is just being ready and prepared to have a new baby. So what about when you bring the baby home? What's, what's the stresses there? Say that again, I'm sorry. When, once you bring the babies home, what kind of problems, what kind of stress do the parents have at that point? It's very stressful. Yeah. I'll, never, I'll never forget when I brought my son home. I thought, oh, now, I, what, do I, now I, what do I do? Now what do I do, <laughs> right. Right, exactly. So I think a lot of new moms, you know, kind of struggle with, um, you, you know, having the right stuff at home. Um, and this is really what the... Um, what this community baby shower is about. So getting those resources to the moms who need it. Um, with the drive, we're kind of collecting um, different supplies, diapers, wipes, um, and different, um, uh, you know, onesies or other baby products for the babies just to help make that transition a little bit smoother. Yeah, it's wonderful. It's donation of all baby essentials, anything you can possibly mm -hmm. imagine. And when you're talking to women who are expecting, does this issue ever even come up? Do you ever talk about the costs associated with bringing a child into the world? Right, right. That's a good question. So, um, you know, I think a lot, a lot, a lot of new moms are especially stressed out about this. Um, you know, you get flooded with, with different uh, baby products and different, um, you know, things that you kind of need. And I think especially for people in the community who may not have the resources, um, you know, it's hard to, to kind of get your hands on that. And so we're trying to help, um, you know, support, support the moms that are not otherwise able to get these products. So just grab some products and drop them off and mm -hmm. help out a young family. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So we have donation bins um, at Viridian Homes over at Associated Physicians. Um, and then you can also find out more information with the Channel 3000. And then later, Project Babies will collect all the items and will actually hold a baby mm -hmm. shower for moms in our community. And all that information is on yeah. Channel 3000. And we'll talk about it right here on Live at 4 on Wednesday. Yes, that's right. Doctor, thanks for being with us today. Great to see you, Dr. Masana. Thank you so much. Thank you. Just to repeat, now you can drop off new or generally used baby items at two locations through Wednesday at the main office for Viridia Homes on Southtown Drive, off the Beltline or Associated Physicians on Regent Street.